Hello! Welcome back to Hogwarts Legacy. The scenery might look a little weird compared to where we last left off. As we all know, this past week I had setup issues because I wasn't in my usual location, okay? I am at my normal setup, which I'm hoping you can tell from the audio being normal again. However, I may or may not have messed with my settings on my recording stuff to try and fix some lag issues, which I think I fixed anyways. Oh, that didn't really look like it, but we're gonna hope. Anyways, I may or may not have changed a setting that made it so the video I recorded was not readable. However, I don't know enough about the logistics stuff of videos and whatnot. But moral of the story is I recorded a whole video and now I literally cannot post it because I can't even edit it. The video is just not there. The audio is, but not the video. So that's fine. Um, basically, I'm just going to sum up what happened. Nothing crazy did, thankfully. We did a couple side quests. Um, I've decided that in the next few episodes, because we're getting very, very close to the end, I think, I'm probably going to do a couple episodes focusing on, like, side quests and doing, like, Merlin trials and whatever. I most likely will be cutting a lot of that out, but that's just my little warning that there's probably going to be some funky episodes coming up. So just, there you go. The things that we did, um, I don't really remember the side quests fully. We did one with Deke, and that was the most exciting one, which is why we are here, because we got the phoenix. There he is, and all his glory over there. Yep, look at him. So it was really fun. We also completed all of the broom quests. We just have to go back to Albi for the last upgrade, but I'm pretty sure that's the end of the quest. That's what it sounded like. It said I finished them. I got the achievement, so... Thinking that's done. Otherwise, yeah, I didn't do any main quests, thankfully, so we didn't miss anything like that. But I swear, if this video does not work, I'd be a little upset. But let's go check and see what we have to do. I know it's the classic moon and keys, and then two Sebastian quests. I think I'm going to start with this one. This one's stressing me out because it's meeting Sebastian and Anne. I'm just, I don't know. The whole Sebastian thing right now is making me very nervous about what is going to happen. Okay, I'm so anxious for this. What's going Sebastian, on? A lost relic from a catacomb which requires a dark sacrifice. I know how it sounds, but if this can help you, it's worth the risk. Does Ominous know about this? He helped find the scriptorium where we discovered Slytherin's spellbook. Very well. If Ominous will be there, I'll meet you. We don't have much time. Solomon wants to leave Feldcroft. What? What? Leave? Never mind. You need to stall him. Buy us time, Anne. Please. Bro. I shall do my best. I'll be in touch. What is happening? Solomon can't take Anne from Feldcroft. Where would they go? When would I see her? Bro, I don't know. Sebastian. I can't believe my uncle wants to leave Feldcroft. Anne's going to stall him. She must. We need time. Time? For what? I've learned more about the relic. <laughs> I cross-referenced Slytherin's spellbook with everything in the library on relics and dark sacrifices. That's when I realized something. I believe the relic will only work inside the catacomb. Sebastian, what? <laughs> um, this is definitely more complicated than we thought, for sure. So we have to get Anne to the catacomb and then conduct a sacrifice. Seems risky. It'll be worth the risk. Is Our it? biggest hurdle may be convincing Ominous. Anne will only give this a chance if he's on board. And we have to keep all of this from your uncle. If he goes to the headmaster, we could be expelled. Let me handle Ominous this time. As for my uncle, he's not an aura anymore. What he oh. doesn't know, well, won't hurt us. Seems like a bad idea. Do you think your uncle would tell anyone at the ministry about all of this if he found out? If he found out, I doubt he'd go to the ministry. He didn't part ways with them well, from what I understand. Oh. He won't say, but I believe his strong aversion to dark magic has something to do with his time there. Anne uh. thinks he once decided to fight fire with fire, so to speak, and resorted to using an unforgivable curse and fight against dark wizards. At least that's what she thought she heard. When he realized what his job had led him to become, he left rather abruptly. Okay. So, I'm not sure he'd go to the ministry to report on his own family using dark magic now. 
Well, that's meh. Good luck with Ominous. Until we meet again. I shall let you know when the four of us should meet at the catacomb. Look for my owl. See okay. you soon. When can I get new glasses? I'm tired of having this weird, like, dragon eye thing. Well, that quest went a lot smoother than I thought. It didn't actually have me do anything, but this is not going to go well. I already know. Uh, okay, well, the other quest we have to do is the Sebastian quest. So we're going to have to go all the way over to the other side of the map, pretty much. I think what I'm going to do to try and finish is my... What is going on? I thought I fixed this. I think what I'm going to do to try and finish as much as possible is instead of like flying everywhere like I usually do, I'm going to deal with it and walk everywhere. So then I hit stuff along the way like the Merlin trials and the ancient magic spots and yada yada all that good stuff. Oh my gosh. No. It's a parkour one? No way. I did not expect to have to do parkour in this game. Okay, one. That one was easy. Okay. Oh, did I do it? I did it! Just for uh, video purposes, this is actually my fourth Merlin trial I've done. This is just so far the most interesting one. <laughs> I haven't done a parkour one yet. Out of all of them I've done. Will I die if I jump from- Oh. I did. <laughs> Reason from last oh my god, what was I talking about? Oh hallelujah. <laughs> okay, well we're not doing that again. Okay, what kind of trouble is he gonna get us into this time? I'm not prepared. Nothing pleasant about this coast. Yeah, tell me about it, dude. You're the one that made me come here. I received your <laughs> Thank you. I'm glad you came. I spotted droves of Ranrock's loyalists coming up from the coast. Overheard one of them say they're headed to another cavern, like the one we found. How are they still one step ahead of us? They can't know about the triptych. I don't know. I did see another memory. This time it was a keeper named Neve Fitzgerald. She was unnerved by Isadora's use of ancient magic. But I still can't be sure how any of it connects to Ranrock. These keepers are playing games with you. You need to press them for more information. It doesn't work like that. To access each of these memories, I have to complete a trial. It's not as easy as you think. They're showing me the memories in a particular order. They- Oh, either they don't trust you, or you don't care enough about Anne to ask the difficult Are questions. Are you kidding me? Bro, be for real right now. I don't see you doing any of the trials. Do you have the special ancient magic power? No, exactly. Of course I care, Sebastian. We've come this far. Don't let your frustration get the better of you. Fine. I'll defer to your keeper friends. For now. But I don't like it. Whatever. We don't have a choice. Now, shall we see where the triptych lead is here? Gilk. Let's go, quickly. Before we're spotted. He's becoming so bleh. Keep a close eye out. I saw some of Ranrock's crew moving off the path just ahead. Did I already I kill why. them? <laughs> Raiding, I imagine. This mountain used to safeguard local hamlet valuables. Oops. But it's been abandoned ever since Ranrock took hold of the coast. Well, I think I might have just done it beforehand, but like, I'm not going to complain. <laughs> I bet the Thestral Nest is close by. Yeah. Kill any of trespass. Uh oh. There they are. Let's go. Wait, we should have some sort of plan. I'm through planning. Whatever, dude. I'm gonna be the one that has to kill all of them anyways. 
did it. They got what they deserved. He is getting ill. What were you thinking? I was thinking about dead goblins. You could have got us killed. But I didn't. Because of me. Looks like Branrock's loyalists were heading further up the path. Let's keep going. Whatever that is. Did you hear that goblin? Ridiculous notions of ownership. <laughs> Hello. How do I get up here? Uh... Oh, I did it. Pfft. Apparently I just had a weak jump before. Okay, nothing new. Oh. Hey! Are you dead? Ha 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 ha. Sebastian. Get. Chickens? Who is this? Oh my gosh. Okay. Dear resident, your chicken coop inspection will occur in two weeks' time in accordance with the ministry's investigation into rumors of the illegal breeding of basilisks. Please ensure that your premises are toad free and be reminded that the punishment for such illegal breeding endeavors is lifelong detention in Azkaban. Please contact the Department of Regulation and Control of Magical Beasts Ministry of Magic with any questions. Who's this? I don't know what this has to do with the story, but mm, it's fine. Oh. Dead wizard. Ranrog's got that right. And I'll be most keen to help him achieve his goal. Hey guys. Ow. Oof. This must be it. Sebastian, wait. Wait? For what? Uh, why are you suddenly so cautious? Listen to me. I know you're angry and frustrated, but charging ahead now could undo all the progress we've made. Lord Gok said... Oh, your goblin friend? Stop it, that's enough. Not all goblins are like Ranrock. I am not the enemy. We want the same thing, to find answers. I thought we wanted the same we thing. We do. Listen to me. Lord Gok has insights into Ranrock that we don't. He told me that Ranrock somehow knows about the Keepers and is searching anywhere connected to each of them. That's why they always seem to be one step ahead. I know what I'm doing. You need to trust me, or I don't see that we can continue together. Fine. Fine. I'm sorry. I'm letting my emotions get the better of me. And I have been for a while. Uh-huh. I do trust you. And I don't think I can help Anne without you. Good. Ranrock clearly knows more than we thought. We need to be careful and do this right, not just go charging in. We have our work cut out for us. We need to work together if we're going to find the final piece to the triptych. Okay. Agreed. So why all of a sudden he's like, oh, you're right, it's fine. Because, <laughs> come on. I feel like we need to start making bets on how long it takes for Sebastian to fully lose it. Because he keeps, like, teetering. <laughs> okay. Sebastian. Okay, we're good. Let's go. So far, so good. I didn't like that noise. Charming. What? Whoa. Whoa. Spiders. How fitting. Stop it. Oh my god, there's more. Why are spiders everywhere? I, like, um... Hey, that's rude. Oh. God dang it. Okay. Stop it. Spiders are determined to make a meal of us. Clearly. I'm sure we taste better than a goblin dinner. I don't know. I'd be more content with them eating the goblins. That's just me. Okay. Annoying little beasts, aren't they? They're not even annoying. I just don't like spiders. <laughs> like, they really aren't that hard to beat. A staircase leading here. Whatever for? 
I don't think anyone's been here for ages. Look at this place. Not really my style. A bit much, if you ask me. Oh, I hated that. Hated every single second of that. There's two. Oh my god. There we go. Okay. Getting through the cavern can't have been the only challenge. Perhaps we should search for runes. There's one. Oh my gosh, it's because it's in the spiders. Like these before. Sebastian, sometimes you say, like, painfully obvious things. Yes, we know that we've seen them before. It's kind of the point. Is finding these chests luck or instinct? Uh, finding them is because I am determined to find every single secret of this game, even though I know I've already missed them. <laughs> but I'm gonna keep trying. I'd imagine we need to find all three rules to open the doors. Can't get out of here quick enough. Yay! Uh... Oh, I've had a breakthrough. The power that I honed with my professors. Oh wait. This feels weird. With which I conjured and built such pretty pillars must be tempered sus substantially for the much more delicate endeavor which I now undertake. It feels somewhat like removing a memory, but the magic is wholly different. As I withdrew the merest whisper of pain from just above the heart, a faint haze appeared and then just as quickly seemed to dissipate. I sensed a surge of peace myself, as though I knew I... I knew instantly that what I was doing was right. I wonder now if the haze may be contained, if memories can be stored in a pensive. Surely these extractions can be kept safe for further study. Well, we know that's true. Bastion, a journal entry. We should look for more. Why couldn't she have kept all our journal entries in one place? You know, I do agree. However, I'm not shocked. Because, like, that'd be too easy. Oh. Let me guess, more spiders. Oh, uh, nope, that's roll. <laughs> oh. Dang, dude. You just... That was too intense for my game, apparently. <laughs> well. No way I just let myself dog because I forgot to heal. Oh my god. <laughs> Sebastian just got <laughs> Sebastian just got destroyed. <laughs> Oof. Nice team. Nothing like an angry troll to bring friends together. Yeesh. No way, he just- I wish I would have seen that. <laughs> I think I broke him. <laughs> oh boy. Sorry, Sebastian, I did you dirty. That <laughs> troll certainly made a mess of things. Debris yeah. everywhere. Repair. I'm assuming we have to repair it. That was a piece of work. More than one. Do I have to do it again? Why is there still stuff like... Oh, yes there was. <laughs> we good now? Okay. Okay, but where is the other notes? I feel like we should have found another one by now. What? Aha. Oh boy, this is a long one. Buckle up. Such joy I felt helping my father after all these years. To hear his voice again, I cannot begin to describe how much I've missed it. We couldn't jump high enough to reach that ledge if we tried. Sebastian, I am reading. I confess I was wholly stunned by the Keeper's reaction. I should have expected it. How can they stand by and do nothing when they have the power to do so much good? Oh, so this is Isadora then. 
Who is Professor Rackham to tell me what I can and cannot do with my ability? The audacity of all of them, judging my work without any real understanding of all that I've accomplished. I do have some hope. The headmistress seems somehow to understand what I was doing. When the time is right, I shall go to her. She may be able and willing to help. And so I know otherwise, I must continue my work alone, for now. But I will find- something sturdy to stand on. Dude. I must continue my work alone for now, but I will find someone to help me. I will find someone else who understands the gift that we've been given and our obligation to use it. I will store what I learned safely away from the moment. One day I'll be able to share it with another who is like me. Okay, that Did makes me nervous. Something? Yes. The the tree. Is the here? Yeah, and you kept interrupting me, bro. A breath after all of those stairs, but the view, well worth it. That's dramatic. <laughs> it's not even that cool. What is that? Ugh. Okay, so not that way. How many more of these journal entries do we need to find? I wish sometimes they have numbers, and this time they don't. What? Another barrier. We can blast through it. I'm certain. Ooh, okay. I feel more and more capable each day. My sense of purpose, knowing that what I am doing is precisely what I was meant to do, has never been clearer. The number of souls I have been able to help grows by the day. So much pain. And I have discovered that this magic itself somehow confirms that what I am doing is right. Each time I breathe in the haze, ew, even a little, it's as though I become more capable. I am being rewarded for my courage, rewarded for using this magic the way it was meant to be used. I fear, however, that I must find a way to store what I cannot use in the moment. I do not yet understand its power and do not want to leave it to chance. I have an idea. It is not without risk, but I feel the risk is worth it. Oh boy. Good news. This journal entry sounds worrisome. That's one way to put it. This can't be a dead end. Must be another floor above us. Incendium. Okay, but where is the thing? Uh, almost as good as if I'd done it myself. Wait, I'm confused though. Oh, no, there's. Mm, never mind. I was just getting ahead of myself. Skirt. This place can't have belonged to only Isadora. Another rune symbol. Feel as if I should what? be fluent in runic language by now. Where? Is there another one? Bombarda. Oh, I see. Oh. Not sure what I did to deserve that. Run, 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 run. Boom, did it. Isadora must have honed her skill with ancient magic here. Seven of. Hold on, how many have I found? I don't think I read seven. No. Oh no. Oh wait. Isadora, one, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, we're fine. We got them. Okay, I did not think I've read seven of them. How could I have been so terribly wrong? The headmistress won't help me. I tried to make her understand. She, like the others, is blind to the possibilities of what I could do. Well, maybe when you, like... Do... Because we saw that, like, last episode or the episode before, where she, like, sucked the pain out of her and then ate it. <laughs> I feel like most normal people would be freaked out by that. Anyways, I have come to learn that I can rely on no one, but I am more powerful witch than I have ever been, and I know that it's due to the work I'm doing. I shall not allow my magic to lie dormant, as the Keepers do. How I despise that ridiculous name, as if keeping power all to themselves is something to be lauded? I don't know what that is. I confess I have begun to wonder if I will ever find another in my lifetime with whom I can share this work. If I do not, then I shall find solace in the, the knowledge that I have left them a trail to follow, a path from which they can learn. Perhaps they will do what I cannot heal the world. Mm. I know from the memory 
things I've seen, the Keepers and Isadora didn't see eye to eye on the use of ancient magic. I wish you could see one of her memories. <laughs> well, uh, this is, I feel like, gonna end up tricky. Oh my god, is it gonna make me pick which side to be on? Oh no. I'm not prepared for that. Another ancient magic passageway to the Undercroft. The final piece of the triptych must be here. Where? Oh. Duh. Aha! I got it. This piece of the triptych. We've done it. Oh, well, Isadora should not have had to keep all this secret. I know from the memories I've seen that the keepers in Isadora didn't see eye to eye on the use of ancient magic. But I don't understand why she seems to have gone to such great lengths to tell her story without their knowledge. I wish you could see one of her memories. So do I. Perhaps completing the triptych will shed more light on all of this. Maybe. I'm confused now. Like, was Isadora actually good? And she just kind of went off the rails a little bit when, like, no one would listen to her? Or I, I don't know. I don't know how to think about it. <laughs> I cannot believe the journey this triptych took us on. <laughs> no kidding, dude. Oh, this is a lot. Oh my god, we really are getting this close to it. the end. Don't keep me in suspense. Go on, place it. I'm scared. What's it gonna do? Imagine she pops out. <laughs> Why would I not be shocked? Oh. Another pencil. This is what we've been chasing. I wonder... What is it? Let's find out. He's like, uh... <laughs> this is hers, then. Cannot bring my brother back, Father. But I can give you peace. Please have a seat. Isadora. <laughs> We are all most intrigued to hear. We're ready. I've something to show you. Should Sebastian be seeing all this? Father, these are my colleagues from Hogwarts. Father hasn't spoken since my brother died. On my travels, I confirm that which I've always believed. That we have the power to take away pain. Ugh, it's so freaky. Isadora. Indeed. Of course it did. It's goblin silver. I need something much bigger. All right. It would help if you could tell me more about what it is you're storing. Um. Magic. Left over from a spell I devised to remove pain, but if used correctly, its power can be used to do even more good. Why would you want to store such magic away? I only need to keep it safe until I can convince my colleagues of its worth. Magic like this unnerves them. Well, everyone's ready to wield such power. 
Perhaps not. Someone will be. Please don't make it be me. She took away the pain. I knew it. I knew there was a way to help Anne. Oh no. Something isn't right, Sebastian. What do you mean? You saw what she did. No, not the memories, the portrait. I I think the reason Isadora hasn't appeared is because she can't. I don't know. Huh? We have seen that view before. The abandoned home in Felcroft, the destroyed painting. It was her. So someone destroyed a bit of enchanted canvas, but we found the memory. You're not listening, yes. dude. Yes, you're right. We saw what she wanted us to see. We saw what she could do, what you can do. Oh, bro. I don't Ooh. know how to do what Isadora did. Well, then you shall learn. The Keepers can teach you. I'm not sure that they would. The Keepers believe that removing someone's ability to feel pain, it's a highly complicated, unpredictable form of magic. One that should be wielded with great care, if at all. If at all? You've overcome all of their challenges. You've more than proven yourself. You can wield it. You have the ability. Um. <laughs> Please. Talk to the keepers. If not for me, then, then for Anne. I. Mm, this is such a not good situation. Ew, that was smile was creepy. <laughs> Why did the keepers want to keep Isadora quiet? Why destroy her portrait? There... There is something so funky going on. I feel like we need to go to where... Okay, this is what I'm gathering here. In this portrait, right? My girl in the cutscene was like, oh, there's something wrong, blah, 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 this place in Felcroft. Isn't probably there's some- I found one of Randrock's drills in a mine along the shore. I intend to destroy it. I'm tired of trying to reason with him. You are welcome to join me, but if I don't see you there, I will reach out when I return. I have something to give you. So what, is that like a time-sensitive one? Because I don't want to do that right now. Rock's getting himself into more danger than he realizes. Might better find him. Oh. Okay, here's my thing. Wherever the location is in this portrait, right? Could it be that there's another thing there that Isadora is in? Just like the Keepers are? Or am I looking into that wrong? I don't know. Well, let's see. What does it even want us? Okay, that's literally all it gave us. Okay, that's fine. I'm honestly gonna leave it there. Uh, that uh, I I am so intrigued and nervous how the story is gonna go. <laughs> At least Sebastian is kind of on our side again, but he's still kind of going off the rails. So I don't know. His I feel like his story is supposed to be like the parallel to Isadora's, and I'm curious how it's gonna end. But anyways, that's that. Hopefully you enjoyed. <laughs> Um, but yeah, we're gonna leave it here. I will see you all next week for more Hogwarts Legacy. Bye!